There's a couple different ways to make maze worksheets on Canva. You can just use the maze elements that are free and they have easier hard ones. Or you can go into Activities Maker and it has a maze section and it has different settings that you can choose. And this generated this maze. So you can see the difference in thickness a little bit of the maze, but it has a start and end point and it gives you an answer key um, that you can like use in your product as well. I've always just used the pre-made mazes in the elements tab and then made a page of the element theme that I want to make like say graduation end of the year and then kind of played around with different layouts for mazes and then made like a product. But let's play around with the activities maker settings. So let's up the path thickness. Um, let's see what it looks like at the max and the point radius. And I made the rows and columns less. Let's make it really easy and see what, how different it looks. So you click generate and it gives you the answer key and the maze on the same page. I just wish the lines could be a little thicker. I don't know if, let's see. Let's see if this works. No, that's just the border of the outside but it looks like you can generate multiple puzzles, like four or up. And this is good for if you're making a huge bundle. It says generating your mazes, it's doing like one per page. But this is good because every maze is different because um, the elements one, I kind of have the same mazes over and over with different themes. This one, you know, they're all gonna be different. So that's fun. Let's see what the hardest maze is, 50 by 50 because maybe you need that for like a really difficult upper grade. Oh my goodness, that's too much.